We got the tip on Hamilton from a sergeant in the Southwestern. We got a warrant from a judge. I put a track on the car. Had a big old house out in Carroll County with a pool. <laughs> a fucker was a monster, shit. You had authority for the tracker? Hell no. Did that on my own. Anyway, after we decided to do, you know, the thing, we followed the Hamiltons to Rice's Town Road. And jacked them up. I found a roll of cash on Hamilton right there. Over there. Over there. Shit had to be drug money. So I knew we had the right dude. Don't talk to her. Sergeant Jenkins there? No. He was at the barn. You see, the plan was to bring them there and then to introduce Jenks as a U.S. attorney. <laughs> Jenkins as a U.S. attorney. Oh, no offense intended there. <laughs> Sir, I can see from your file here that you are a smart individual. Now, as a federal prosecutor, I have been dealing with these kind of cases for quite a while. I'm just going to tell you, full candor, Mr. Hamilton, you are looking at a serious amount of years unless you start giving us the right answers. Now, look, we have you on three separate control buys. Man, get we... the fuck out of here. Okay, first off, I'm not mad. Okay, so let's just do that again. I'm a U.S. attorney, okay? What up? And I don't sell no drugs. Man, what are you doing? <laughs> you have multiple federal drug convictions. You did six years because of those convictions. It says that right there. What do you think you're going to do? You think you're going to outsmart me? Now, let's try this shit again. You currently own this home in, uh, in Westminster, correct? Do you currently have quantities of drugs at that home? He don't like talking much, huh? No. I'm sorry, you, you're, you're hearing what I'm saying, right? I'm hearing you perfectly fucking clear. Am I not talking loud enough? What is it? You want me to be slower? What is it? Is it no, in pronunciation? You, what do you fucking think the fine. deal is? Yeah. You do you currently have quantities of drugs at your home in Westminster? Well, shit. Guess we're just going to have to go out there and find out. Hamilton's house was nice. Boom! Yahtzee. Hey, yo. Ooh, 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 ooh. I see you money. Yo, about that shit. Personally, Gondo found money. But no drugs. All right, man. Yep. Hell yeah. He left Herschel in a room, which was a mistake. We were downstairs, waiting on the state police to arrive. 50K. Where the rest of it at? How you gonna take my money? I earned that gambling selling cars. I get it all. We're seizing this under forfeiture laws. You'll have a chance to account for it later. That's some bullshit. Appreciate it, fellas. Y'all get home safe, all right? You left after that. Jenkins wasn't done. Man, this is a nice-ass crib, man. I tell you. Is that what you call it? It's your crib. Hmm. Ah, damn. This is a long ass drive, man. So we're gonna need something. <laughs> oh man, where the drugs at, man? What you got? One of those safes? Ain't no fucking drugs. Okay, but you do know people, right? You know drug dealers. Where's your plug, man? I know you know somebody. Give us a name, baby. Look, here's the bottom line. You take care of us. We're gonna take care of you. Cause here's the crazy part. One morning you could wake up. 10 kilos in the backyard. You split up the Hamilton money? Yeah. Later that night at a bar, when Gondo went back to the bedroom for the cash, there was the 50, and then there was the loose 20,000. I mean, I had counted more. You know, Herschel must have taken a few thousand when he was up there alone. Of course, I lifted the 3,500 off of Hamilton when we pulled him over. What I'm saying is, we weren't just stealing. All right? We were stealing from each other. Jenkins more than most, though. At that point in time, it was all in it for ourselves, to be honest. But all this while, you knew we were looking at you. You knew there was a federal investigation. 